beauty is only skin deep, Robes. Yeah? No? No. It does. No, there is more to it. There's more. There's more to it. Okay, but we're talking about skin this time. Um, we got to do our best, though, no matter what, to take care of our skin. That's right. So here to help us master the basics of skin care is the dermatologist with all the need-to-know info, Dr. Ann Chappas. Doctor, thank you so much for being here. All right, skin here. We, we should be taking care of it differently. Depending on our age, 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, it's all different. Is that right? You're absolutely right. Every age tends to have some different problems. In our 20s, I see a lot of patients who are still having problems with acne. And unfortunately, acne isn't something that just goes away when we're teenagers. For a lot of people, it persists and is very distressing when they're getting into their 20s. But fortunately, there are some really great over-the-counter products that have salicylic acid in it that can help patients treat and prevent acne. And they have uh, the product that you see here has salicylic acid cleanser. It's from Obagi. It's called Cleansiderm. And people can use it twice a day to break down the clogged pores on their skin. Now, after their 20s, though, in our 30s, we start to see some of the sun damage and some of the environmental damage. And patients often present in the office with discoloration, sunspots, redness. And at that time in our 30s, I really encourage patients to start using antioxidants. And antioxidants are a great way to kind of prevent this sun damage, but they also can even make our sun protection even more potent. And then as we move on to the 40s, it's all about wrinkles and skin laxity. So a lot of patients ask me, what can I do about this stuff? I said, there's some really great over-the-counter products that, that contain vitamin A. And vitamin A in an over-the-counter product is called retinol. And it's one of our body's key ingredients to help repair fine lines and wrinkles. It helps even out pigmentation. There's some really great over-the-counter products that, that you can find at your local drugstore, and these should be applied nightly. All right, yeah, Dr. Chappitz, you just went through my whole, uh, all three decades. <laughs> I, I had all of those things, and I am currently using retinol, but is there an order to which we should be applying these products? Well, you're absolutely right. You know, as you progress through the decades, you kind of just add on and order is key. I mean, important that we want to apply products on clean skin and we want to apply the thinnest to thickest products. So the first thing you should do in the morning is really wash with a gentle cleanser, use a toner, use an AHA, use your age appropriate treatment product and then use your moisturizer and physical sunscreen. And I really want to stress physical sunscreen of SPF 30 or higher today, because today is Melanoma Monday and we're trying to raise awareness that sunscreen is our best protection against skin cancer. And at nighttime, you can kind of do the same thing. Remember, it's thinnest to thickest. So we want to use our gentle cleanser. You then want to use uh, your toner, your age-specific product. So if you're using retinol, you apply this at nighttime and then a moisturizer to really seal it all in. So we're applying thinner to thickest, and then at the last step is really the sealant. All yeah. right, Dr. Ann Chappas, thank you so much for reaffirming all of my choices. Uh <laughs> <laughs> Stay on track, you're doing great. Indeed, we had a whole, what, last Thursday, we had a- I was like, my skin's like sandpaper. Because I had I, a Fraxel. I didn't understand it. A Fraxel? A Fraxel. <laughs> <laughs> a Fraxel. I'm learning, guys. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.